I'm Taylor Powers, joined here by Bryce Lasky. And uh, fans, for you that don't know Bryce Lasky, he's a pure scorer. Uh, he proved that in high school at Laurel Highlands High School. You averaged 30 points a game in the Whippeal. And uh, it's starting to show now on the court. You're a redshirt freshman, sat out all of last year, and uh, you kind of continue to get more and more playing time, and you've made the most of it. Uh, last time out, 10 points at CCSU. Uh, just talk about your comfort level in your first season and you know how uh, how much more comfortable you are as we start to walk your 94 feet. Uh, yeah, I'm just really getting it more adjusted to the speed of the game. I'm starting to really feel like I'm playing like the way I used to before I had to sit out that year. Talk about the adjustment level for someone like you who scored so much uh, in high school to kind of have to learn how to adjust and fit into a team where there's a Keith Braxton and an Isaiah Blackman. Yeah, with players like Keith and Isaiah, I just have to learn how to pick my spots a little bit better. And I'm still figuring that out on the fly, but it's it's getting easier. You're about to become a household name here in Loretto. What might fans uh, be surprised to learn about Bryce Lasky? Uh, I actually read a good bit. You read? Yeah. What, uh, you currently reading something? Uh, Malcolm Gladwell's latest book, I just finished that up. Okay. So. Uh, I think, you know, you look at the stats, you're leading the team in three-point field goal percentage, but you're not just a pure, uh, pure shooter. You know, you like to get to the basket, have a nice little mid-range game. Is there an NBA player or even a college player that you model your game after? Uh, recently, Buddy Heald. I kind of watched a lot of his stuff from uh, college, but I kind of try to pick from a lot of different people. Buddy Heald. We also have a pretty good mentor on this team, uh, someone who's kind of taken you under his wing. That's uh, senior Scott Meredith. Yeah. Um, you know, what has Scott meant to your growth and development? Um, he's just one of those guys that's always there when I, when I have questions, and he's really just helped that transition from high school to college go a lot smoother.